The following video shows Dr. Graham Sweeney, Medical Affairs APO Regional Manager at IDEX, and Dr. Natalie Matika, Veterinary Specialist at Guide Dogs Queensland, talking about IDEX's valuable support of Guide Dogs and why they love what they do. IDEX proudly partners with Guide Dogs. We recognise the value that Guide Dogs have, that bond between the handler and the dog, it's, it's a working relationship. So any testing we do for guide dogs, be it in, if they're unwell or with preventive care screening, we do as a complementary thing because you can't put a value on what it does. What are you looking for in diagnostic testing for preventive care? When we submit preventive care testing to IDEX on our well dogs, there's a couple of things that I'm looking for. First and foremost, I'd like to know if there is any evidence of underlying disease that's not apparent on a clinical exam. So we'll do things like a blood count to look at the cells in the blood. We do a biochemical profile that looks at things like kidney and liver function, electrolytes and glucose. We look at urine because that can give us information about liver and kidneys and things like diabetes. And we also do fecal testing to look for parasites. The other thing that I'm looking for is the ability to establish a baseline of normal over the lifetime of that dog. Now, finding normal results is the best thing possible because it's telling us that pet's in good health or if we're looking at a guide dog that they're in good health. But those results give us value not only today to say they're healthy, but we can look at results in the future compared to those normal results and it can help us detect changes sooner that we can maybe do something about. What is the likelihood that something abnormal is found? If we look at the likelihood of us finding something on this testing, this is something I can give you a pretty solid answer for because there's been work done, looked at over 250,000 dogs and cats having a, a health screen and the preventive care testing. What we found on that is that one in seven young adults, one in five mature adults, and two in five senior dogs and cats had changes that were considered to warrant further examination. What does this mean for the average pet? Just like a guide dog, a pet dog or a cat can be good at hiding illness. So I'd emphasize to pet owners, regular health checks, you know, take your, your dog or cat into the vet every year for a health check. You know, at some of those health checks, the vet may recommend doing this preventive care screening. So, same rule applies to the guide dogs. We can potentially find things that aren't apparent on that examination early and do our best to try and correct them or manage them. What do you love about your job? You know, there are so many things I love about being a vet. Um, you know, the interaction with the clients and the owners. I've seen a huge range of different animals over the years working. Um, I also love teaching, so in the role I'm in now, um, working at IDEX, I get to do a lot of teaching with you know, the team within and outside of IDEX, so I get a huge amount of satisfaction from doing that. And in my role here at Guide Dogs, I get to track their progress throughout the entire program up until the point when they're ultimately placed with clients as working guide dogs. It's incredibly satisfying to get to see the results of everyone's hard work out on the streets helping someone with vision impairment live a more fulfilling life. The IDEX logo and words proudly supporting guide dogs for over 10 years appear.